With only 32 games left in the regular season and a chance at winning their first National League West title, the Rockies cannot afford to have only three-fifths of their rotation performing well on the mound. From the Denver Post Sports Desk, I'm Carrie Ann Keough. The Cardinals' defeat of the Rockies on Sunday afternoon was ugly to say the least. Starter Tyler Anderson gave up six runs on seven hits, lasting just two-thirds of an inning, the shortest start of his career. The first inning has been miserable for the Rockies all season, but has been especially atrocious for Anderson, who has now given up 36 runs in the first over his 26 starts, including 11 home runs. In August, Tyler Anderson is 0-4 with an 11.39 ERA after going 1-0 over five starts in July with a 2-1-6 ERA. What is the difference between July Anderson and August Anderson? He swears it's not injury or fatigue that has him down, that his pitch command is 100% to blame, but something has got to shake up soon or the Rockies are in for a world of heartache as they fight for a shot at the postseason. Looking forward this week, the Rockies will have a two-game interleague series against the Angels, followed by four games against the Padres. John Gray is scheduled to take the mound first on Monday night to kick off the road stretch, but it's a late one Rockies fans with first pitch scheduled for 8 p.m.